what else? What else did I want to talk about? What else was a big... F- oh, you know what I started to watch? I started to watch... Before I came down, I'm taping this... Uh, I'm taping this Sunday night. I started to watch the Trump-Hillary debate. I mean, I, I just still cannot fucking believe these are our two choices. And, uh, dude, Trump... I got to give it up to Trump, dude. That guy's one-liners. Are just for a, for a politician, Jesus Christ, he's fucking... He kills. The guy fucking kills. He's great on his feet. He'd make a terrible president. He's got no idea what the fuck he's doing or what he's even talking about. It's just like the dope versus the devil. You know, and I know everybody, oh, that old fucking, you know, that shit that he said, I just go up, I grab him by the pussy. I mean, nobody just does that. (laughs) I felt bad for Billy Bush. You know, he was just sitting there. He's like, he's sitting there, some fucking unknown 2005, you know. He's still kind of unknown, you know. Billy Bush, I'm going to talk about people who are in movies. He's not in a movie, you know? He's a talking head. Cut the guy a little slack. He's sitting there with the Don. The Don's talking shit. He's talking about women, you know, as guys do. I just walk right up and I kiss him. You know, I grab him right by the pussy. You know, Billy's just like, this is Donald Trump. Like, you know, you get caught up in the fame. Oh, yeah, yeah, grab by the pussy. <laughs> he just went along with it. You know, stay strong, Billy Bush. You shouldn't have deleted your fucking... Tw- twitter account man you should have hung in there fuck these people they just they get mad for like three fucking days you know what i mean it's unfucking believe he's gonna get more shit for that than fucking hillary's gonna get for the goddamn you know classified fucking emails classified information through her own fucking email and just somehow that all goes under the right i cannot stand i can tell when hillary's lying too she that smile she does you can see it in her eyes when she's lying and trump is like I I I I just don't. He's like a fucking cartoon character. Like Alec Baldwin as Trump is more believable than Trump as Trump. That's how fucking nuts this guy is. So I started to watch it. Oh man, Trump had some funny ones. He said to Hillary, "He said if I was running this country, you'd be in jail." <laughs> you know what's funny? To really see how hard Donald Trump goes, this is a clip. I don't know if you can still find it. The, the first time Donald Trump was on Letterman and he and Rosie O'Donnell had said something about him and he went off on Rosie O'Donnell and he goes, well, you know, she's a degenerate. And like it was just so over the top. Letterman was laughing, just going like, Donald, you just can't go around saying that about people. And he's just like, you yeah, know, it's true. She's overweight. He just fucking like. Just no filter, just went right after him. And uh, I, he hasn't changed at all since he's become a politician. Having said that, like, I, I you know, doesn't mean he's going to make a good president. He's just, you know, I can't, get, I can't get past how many overtly racist people love the guy. And that's, that's always a major red flag. You know what the fuck it is with this fucking election? It's like you either got the guy that's going to rally up the fucking neo-Nazis the guy that rallies up the white guys that think that there's something being taken away from them, you know, or you got Hillary, you know, but he's actually, you know, or you got Hillary who's actually gonna, she's going to be in bed with the corporate cunts up at the fuck. It's like a lose, lose. Either you got somebody like rallying up this fucking cesspool of people at the bottom uh, as far as mental, I'm not talking financially, Mentally speaking, or you got Hillary who's just, you know, she's going to give them their wars. She's going to let the fucking robots be made and all that. You know, I don't know. I I don't know what that. Oh, my God. It's just fucking it's and her fucking pantsuits. That's the only thing I like about her. I love the pantsuit. If I was a chick, I would wear fucking pantsuits. I mean, you got to go with it. At some point, as a woman, you reach your pantsuit age and you just got to give into it. That's like a man. At some point. You got to stop wearing your tag tops and you got to put on a sport coat. All right. Try to keep the carbs low. Do the best you can. You know, at some point you just get to that fucking age. Like uh, that. I see. I, I do have to say, though, this presidential election and these two choices is one of the most depressing fucking things uh, I've been around in a long fucking time. I can't believe I just can't fucking believe it's a reality TV show star or the fucking devil who. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy.